come into a site that is normally buzzing with construction activity and it's as silent as it could be and you just have your time to kind of gather yourself, mentally prepare for the day and get everything ready for my team and our trade partners. Nobody in our lifetime has really dealt with a pandemic inside of construction or out. You can't see it. You don't even know if you have it. You could be asymptomatic, you could show no signs, and it's hard to fight an enemy that you can't see. So I feel that the most important thing is safety culture on site. My name is Eddie Mercer, and I'm a COVID ambassador for Suffolk Construction. My typical morning routine is to show up about a half an hour before any workers are scheduled to start, which in our current condition is about 4.30 in the morning. Having a large number of employees on the site presents itself with a real challenge of how do you manage that size of a workforce? And the answer is gonna be culture. So if we can develop a culture where these guys are doing the right thing and looking out for each other, looking out for themselves, then it's almost like having 300, 400 COVID ambassadors on the site opening up the mind of everyone on site is a huge win. Just to be mindful of your surroundings, be mindful of the people around you, mindful of what you touch. Basic things that everybody touches every single day. Personally, my favorite part of the job is interacting with each individual on site, forming relationships with them, and just knowing the people that you are helping protect. I'm just the one trying to lead the charge, try to get everyone on board. In my opinion, the way to do that is to care about them, make it clear that you know, we're doing this for the right reasons. Wearing the mask, staying six feet apart, it's all protecting yourself, it's protecting your coworkers, protecting your family, and doing it for the loved ones. It really feels now that my reach extends farther than the site.